on equipped with the knowledge new experience and lifetime memories from your time at this great institute university college of engineering i have no doubt that you will positively impact thousand of lives over the course of your career i have confidence in your talent your determinations and the you have received today a total of 23 gold medals rank certificates cash awards and 323 graduates will be receiving their degrees on the eve of graduation day 2024 i am privileged to introduce our beloved chief guest sri n balram irs chairman and managing director singarani calories companies limited hyderabad he was very much instrumental in evolving formulating various business policies pertaining to financial management budgetary control taxation and internal audit before this prestigious assignment sri balram served as a deputy commissioner of mumbai port and in charge of special investigation and intelligence branch for facilitating international trade sri balram please put all your hands together is a proud albanian is usmanian and having pursued ma m phil public administration from usmania university he love for planting of sapling is truly amazing and he is known as green activist heartily welcome you sir for this grand academic event sri gopal tk krishna is known for superb academic achievements thus reflecting is unwavering commitment to lifelong learning and service as an inspiration to younger generation sri gopal tk krishna b electrical engineering class of 1968 is the founder and president krishna engineering consultants iowa state united states of america he is a recipient of many outstanding awards in usa is generous support by the wave of sponsoring a new electrical engineering building is truly amazing usmania university is a proud of his great contribution in the field of electrical engineering his success as an entrepreneur politician and above all your generosity is truly remarkable i heartily welcome you sir for this memorable event today our guest of honor sri srinivasa kakumanu a proud alumnus of electronics and communication engineering is a class of 1995 presently holding the position managing director and chief executive officer mosif technologies limited with 28 years is rich experience in the semiconductor industry where he co-founded 
first pass semiconductor private limited a prominent vlsi design service organization prior to this she srinu was served as a general manager for the vlsi group at saint formerly known as infotech enterprises in india apart from being very successful entrepreneur he is a committed professional educationist dealt with the courses such as digital design physical design at mastip institute of silicon private limited we are indeed proud of all your achievements sir heartily welcome you for this grand event thank you thank you one and all for giving this opportunity thank you sir for your warm introduction of our esteemed dignitaries on to the days we are truly honored to have such distinguished guest with us today to start with the event i would like to invite our guiding force our esteemed principal university college of engineering usmania university professor p chandrashekar sir to address the gathering good evening to one and all chief guest of graduation day 2024 sri n balram garu irs chairman and managing director singrani colleges company limited president of today's function professor p lakshmanand garu registrar usmani university guests of honor sri ts gopalakrishna garu founder president krishna engineering consultancy usa sri srinivas kakuman garu md ceo and md and ceo mastip technologies director cdac president oyu engineering college alumni association director of evaluation examination cell heads of the departments chair persons of board of studies my dear faculty members distinguished alumni outgoing students and their proud parents print and electronic media a warm welcome on behalf of university college of engineering to one and all at the outset i congratulate all outgoing students on receiving certificates gold medals cash awards today on behalf of university college of engineering usman university i proudly declare that distinguished alumni award of 2024 will be presented to sri ts gopalakrishna garu class of 1968 b electrical engineering thank you sir thank you for ac accepting our presentation today Usman University Engineering College we offer 8 UG programs with an intake of 16 in each and 25 PG specializations we have in addition to regular program we have UG and PG programs for working professionals this academic year we are introducing minor and honors program for BE UG students including BFSI that is banking financial services and insurances this academic year we established imagia center for excellence in artificial intelligence and we have we are written memorandum of agreements one with hand matrix quality thought info systems sohan academy and gandhi hospital this academic year we initiated several civil works first among them is 500 capacity boys hostel dining hall is completed and ground floor is also completed it is at the in the progress with the support of singrani colleges we constructed we are started constructing classroom complex for ec department ground floor we completed now we are going for the first floor and third floor also is pipeline we are also constructing a lift in the main building and proudly we announce department of mining engineering building at the university college of engineering we foundation stone is laid and construction work started where 
two crores funding from NTPC and one crore by one of the alumni of 1960, Tella Gopal Rogaru. Another milestone, we are, we are constructing another building, Professor Y. Narasimhan Building, Department of Electrical Engineering, University College of Engineering, where one single hand, Sri, Sri Gopal T. K. Krishna of 1968 batch has donated six, five crores to Five crores to, you know, I mean, for constructing the building. And uh, we are also creating open lean, open leaning place, lawn, in, in front of the Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering, under the CSR of, by Mass Chip Technologies Limited, thanks for the initiation by Sri Srinivas Rogaru, uh, Mass Chip Technologies. In addition to our regular faculty, Professor Bhikshraj, Cornwall University, has accepted to be visiting professor of our department. He is going to offer a course on deep learning with a committed faculty of our, our college. He is going to offer in the next semester on deep learning. And we appointed two chair professors, one sponsored by Singrani College, another one by Coal India Limited. And college has seven professors of practice in various departments. In addition, we have two adjunct professors. United Way of Hyderabad, is an NGO, has provided around 60 lakhs to our 150 students as a scholarship to our students. Students, we have several professional body activities and clubs like IET, IEEE, IEOM, NSS, SAE Baha, music club, sports club, etc. This year we started Google Developer Student Club, Entrepreneur Club and Communication Interpersonal Skills Club. This academic year we are going to start another one for civil and competitive exams also we are going to start another club. And we regularly conduct academic research committee lectures, alumni talks, as well as invited talks. And one, one point I would like to mention uh, on the dais, I'm happy and proud to share of all the dignitaries on the dais are of alumni of Usman University. In this memorable occasion, I wish all the best to my dear students their future endeavor. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for your inspiring welcome address and insightful overview of college activities. Your words have set a wonderful tone for today's occasion and have undoubtedly motivated our graduates. As we move forward with our celebration, it is my pleasure to invite Dr. D. Vijay Kumar Garu, President, OUCE Alumni Association, University College of Engineering, to brief about alumni events. A very good evening to. I'll 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 go from top down. A very good evening to the oldest alum over here, Gopal T.K. Krishnagaru. I think when he graduated from here, I was not born. Followed by Balram Garu, IRS, CMD of Singanity Collieries. Then Srinivas Garu. CMD of and CEO of Moss Chips. Then our distinguished learned professors, starting from Registrar Lakshmanaran Garu, Principal Chandrasekhar Garu, then our CDAC Director Krishnaya Garu, and Examination Branch Director Sankhya Garu. And all learned faculty over here, alums, each one of you who are here, parents and my dear children. I'm sure this is a very memorable day for each one of the children who's graduating over here. <clears throat> the reason is, now you've got wings, you're flying out actually into the real world. So far, whatever we've done in life is 
okay we were under the security of our parents our faculty etc but now i think today is the day that it's declared that you are free and you are flying into the free world one of the key things that if you have observed as the president of the alumni association what i wanted to share with you guys i think yours was the only batch in the last n number of years wherein we could not interact one on one over here physically means your induction program was online right if i am not wrong okay but i think after 6 months when you came here and the journey over the last 3 and a half years we spent together more than 50% of any batch has spent some time or the other with the alumni association we thank you for all the contributions you have made to our alma mater in spending your time and harnessing and building your skills over here and the journey was fantastic especially with this particular batch i would say it was fantastic there so many good leaders that we have seen in this batch and especially from the girl child this batch has got a lot of children who are you know girls wherein we saw a lot of zeal and leadership attributes so we thank you for the relationship i'll not take much time because we already got delayed but observe one thing over here what our principal actually stated he said that all the dignitaries on the dais who are guests today including the distinguished alumni okay distinguished alumni is an alumni but the chief guest and the guest of honors and all of us are alums so i would request each one of you to remember your alma mater wherever you are in life until death first 15 20 years i am positive all of us know that each one of us as are busy in our own lives building our careers getting married you know building our families normally we see a lot of children coming back to their alma mater after 35 to 40 when they reach the age of 35 to 40 please remember all the contributions this institution has made to you and as time goes by each one of us realize that the maximum contribution to our life has been our undergraduate school okay that's this is where you've done your undergraduate that is your bachelor's in engineering so my humble request is to ensure that you remember your alma mater come back it is not necessary that you have to contribute only in terms of monetary over here but please come back also like when our principal was talking about various developments that he was talking about if you take the list 40% of them you can tick off as alumni contributions or some form of alumni intervention with which that came see that's the impact of alumni coming back to the alma mater and giving back so my message to each one of you is the king of virtues is gratitude so i would say that each one of us over here who have graduated you know we should build this virtue of gratitude and remember our alma mater thank you it was a pleasure being with all of you guys and i expect each one of you to come back and be with the alma mater thank you thank you everyone thank you sir thank you so much for your insightful talk your dedication and enthusiasm for our alumni community was truly inspiring sir we are privileged to have with us today 
our esteemed guest of honor, Sri Srinivasa Kakumanugaru, Managing Director and CEO, Mosship Technologies, who is also the distinguished alumnus of our ECE department of class 1995. With immense pleasure, I now invite Sri Srinivasa Kakumanugaru to address the gathering. Uh, distinguished um, dignitaries on the dais and off the dais, and uh, faculty, supporting staff, students, and proud parents. A very good evening to all of you. And uh, first of all, I mean, this is uh, basically a googly to me. I was not actually thinking to speak here because I was not actually prompted. But uh, yeah, it is, it is basically an honor for me to speak in front of you and uh, in front of such a, such a distinguished uh, alumni. And uh, first of all, let me actually congratulate all the outgoing students on this momentous occasion, right? The graduation day, important day for all, for all of you guys. I know four years ago, you basically dreamt of getting into a very good college and um, you, you would have dreamt of getting into a very good branch of your choice. And a um, lot of you would have actually thought that entering into engineering college is going to be end of your trials and all that, right? But um, the train actually never stops. You have to study well. I mean, these four years, I'm sure you would have worked really hard. And uh, I, I basically... Um, heard that there are about 325 students from this campus are graduating today. And there are more than 20 students that are getting gold medal. And I really want to congratulate all of them. And uh, I also want to congratulate all the proud parents. I know how it actually feels as a parent because my daughter did MBBS last year and she was a gold medalist. So I, I knew how, how exciting it would be for uh, parents, right? And um, actually, I mean, I, I, I looked at um, the flow of events. Each speaker is supposed to spend about 10 minutes. So I would uh, like to stay within 10 minutes. And uh, in these 10 minutes, I mean, I'm, I'm trying to, what do you call, gather some thoughts to basically send them as a message to the young, uh, what do you call, young students that are getting into career or um, trying to pursue uh, higher studies. I know a lot of these generation kids, they, they are basically criticized for not listening to parents, not listening to, uh, say, elders. But I would still like to say, I mean, a few things that may sound cliche, but they never go out of passion, I mean, out of fashion. So you guys will have to remember two or three things that uh, I'm planning to talk about. See, I mean, a lot of you might actually be pursuing a career. You might have already gotten a job or you want to get into a job. Or some of you would be pursuing MS or MTech either here or abroad. Or a few of you would have gotten into, uh, would be getting into MBA courses. Whatever you actually do from today, I think one thing that you will have to always remember is you should never stop learning. Learning is something that you will have to do for a lifetime. Because, see, I mean, if you get into a career, you have to keep learning new technologies, new developments, whatever is happening in your industry. If you do not keep yourself up to date, you will become obsolete. And we always tell our engineers to stay relevant. If you have to stay relevant, you have to keep learning. And uh, you, you are all engineering students, and hence I will give you some uh, hypothesis. You would be able to relate it to it. See, every day we have to make some progress in whatever we do. It's called incremental progress. Even if you grow by 1% every day, 1% every day. In a year, in 365 days, you will grow by 1.01 to the power 365, which is about 37. 
that means you would actually become 37 times better than what you were yesterday so you have to focus on incremental progress uh, incremental growth incremental progress there is absolutely no stopping for learning and uh, the growth and the other thing is you you might actually work for about 35 years or so in your life 35 40 years you divide that whole period into five year chunks and at the start of every five year what do you call period you basically think about what you really want to become at the end of first five years or the next five years you need to actually have a plan and work towards it and you can always go to your seniors your managers or your mentors whoever that is and uh, get guidance but you need to basically have a plan unless you have a plan you won't be able to what you call work towards achieving your goal right always always focus on or chase excellence right focus on learning and uh, chase excellence and money will come to you i have seen i mean i am running a company i have actually seen engineers these days right they get get into the industry they are pretty happy but within 2 years or so they are so so what do you call obsessed about earning money quickly see if you actually do not focus on learning but focus on shifting companies just for money you might be okay for the initial 5 6 years but after that the growth is actually going to be stagnated so my advice to you is if you are getting into a career of your choice or industry of your choice please focus initially for about 7 8 years in building foundations because foundation is actually the key for you to do well later don't be focused on the first 5 years because you have to sustain in your industry for 40 years so you have to be ready for the long term uh, what do you call play it is not 2020 it is a test match that you have to play right so that is extremely extremely important and the other thing is you are going to work in teams and uh, you are going to work with uh, different kinds of people coming from different backgrounds different cultures and uh, so on and so forth and uh, you need to basically have the skill of working with people and uh, working in an industry is always what i call working with the people and if you do not have good team skills you will not actually shine in any career that you basically pick up team working culture is something that you will have to develop so for that you need to be kind you need to be what i call very obedient you need to have humility and uh, uh, and you should not be jud judgmental lot of times there might be people who are less privileged or less blessed than you are it is still okay right i mean you can always encourage uh, what you call such colleagues and uh, grow with them there are going to be plenty of opportunities that are awaiting you when i graduated in 1995 the options were limited but when uh, gopal krishna garu uh, graduated in 1968 they were even limited right but now there are plenty of opportunities that are waiting for you you cannot walk into an opportunity you have to grow into an opportunity that is something that you will have to always remember and lot of times success or the talent actually breeds ego and arrogance and you have to watch out that arrogance and ego that might be growing without within you without your notice and you have to drop ego and arrogance if those two are there with you you don't actually need anyone to knock you down they they are going to knock you down so those two things i mean that i want you guys to actually remember and the other thing is always remember i think that is what dr uh, vijay also was actually saying remember your roots remember people you actually who helped you uh, because giving back giving is the best way of living you should always give back to the society that has actually done so much for you and this university has done so much for so many students like us over the last i think 105 years we all should give back to the society and give back to the university right 
something that I want you to actually remember. And um, there is, I mean, if you guys watched the movie uh, Sri Mantudu, right? Right? What is that? If you don't give it back, Tirigi Chek Pote, Lavai Potar, right? So, something that you, you, you really want to keep in mind. And uh, once again, I really want to congratulate all the gold medalists and uh, outgoing students and their proud parents. All the best. Have a good evening. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Your words have provided valuable insights as we celebrate the significant milestone. Your connection to our ECE department makes your message even more meaningful. Next, we have the honor of hearing from our esteemed chief guest, Sri N. Balram Garu, IRS, Chairman and Managing Director, Singareni Collieries Companies Limited, Hyderabad. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in warmly welcoming Sir to address the gathering. Okay. Uh, respected Deas and uh, Professor Lakshmi Nayanasat and our guest of honor, Go, Sri Gopal TK Krishna, an alumni of this college from 1968 and currently the president of the Krishna Engineering Consultants in USA. And uh, Sin was Kaku, Kaku Manugaru and uh, others, Narsimulu Sanke uh, and uh, President OUCEAA. Dr. D. Vijay Kumar Garu, Shamla Garu, and uh, other distinguished guests, Professor B. R. Naik, OSD to VCOU, Ramon Rao, former president, UCE, and uh, Ramlu Garu, controller of examinations, HOD of various engineering departments, chairpersons of various engineering department, professors, senior alumni members of OU, parents, students, press and media. I feel privileged to stand before you. And this uh, under graduation day and edi chala goparoju under ki and uh, specially Nenu Irozu me Mundu Kochi Martanamte Nizanga Adushanga Bhavistanu E first uh, e OU college loan in enter Ella enter Ian in the Chiptano. Yeah, hope it will motivate it. Already you are motivated and you have graduated. But still, I would like to put a few points before you. So my parents, they were in Hyderabad. So my father was uh, working in a gas agency and the parents uh, no daily labor at the coolies. I was also working uh, here in all uh, uh, all the places I can show, hundreds of houses are there, where Vidyanagar, SRT, TRT, Golnaka, CE <laughs> uh, uh, Colony, we have worked. And uh, one fine day, it was, uh, I was in the sixth class, and uh, it was 1992, uh, 93, 92, 93. So one fine day, uh, one person by name Ramesh, uh, he was from Varangal and he was uh, staying with us. Uh, he was. Uh, so, and one day he told me we go to OU. I mean, I was not aware what OU when, when I was in 6th, 7th class. And when I was seeing all the lush greenery and uh, big, you know, all heritage buildings, I felt so happier. 
एंड आई फेल्ट इन माय नो सोल की अरे इज अ गुड इंस्टीट्यूट रियली कैन आई जॉइन हियर कैन आई स्टडी हियर सो इट कुड नॉट बी पॉसिबल एंड सो आई हैव डन माय स्कूलिंग फ्रॉम जर्चरला एंड सम जिला परिषद स्कूल्स and i did my uh, junior college from b r ambedkar junior college uh, baglingampalli and uh, my uh, and i wanted to become engineer or doctor so in childhood no they ask uh, nowadays uh, i mean definitely everybody or 90% of them 90 not 67% of them opt for engineering and the next is medicine and arts it has come down otherwise whenever you used to see in movie it is all are ba mba so those days have gone <laughs> now it is all technology day so that's how I enter into oyu college and uh, degree this is distance education pg it is all distance education and uh, luckily i got married in the intermediate so when i was uh, you know married i was intermediate failed guy and <laughs> so nobody can think and um, ki uh, one would prepare for the civil services and uh, and uh, see and my main is child marriage i got married at the 18 intermediate failed <laughs> so and after in two years babe was baby after two years second baby <laughs> after five years son so with three children and somebody you know uh, and uh, i got a ration card also and i got my admitted doctor in kb kb upal so i think even nowadays also they take some interview with parents so principal asked me what are you doing i said to student are <laughs> you doctor in school you are joining doctor and you are a student yes sir i am a student i mean what you are doing i said i am doing my ma for through distance education so a lot of hardships do come and uh, most of the dignitaries are sitting on dais and half the dais all have come from the such background and uh, so and students those who are graduating today they are luckier because at least their parent thought of them and uh, and uh, today you have com- completing completed your graduation from oi one of the prestigious institution in telangana of course in india so i wish you all of you um, the best luck and um, and um, so and in in mphil again mphil somehow i got admission into mphil so degree pg i could not do but mphil i have studied from arts college i did my mphil uh, from arts college and uh, recently i did my mba also i have done ma history i have done ma ppm so i have mean, though this marriage and uh, distance education how start your studies how to start the studies but i always believed in education so that that made me to stand before you and uh, all the graduating friends are any service who, whatever whatsoever the profession so graduation complete ayin varaku oka chinna ette evaraina with ias kani or a big political leader kani minister kani but the day starts from where you go uh, start working and uh, you have to face different uh, managements bosses chairmen and uh, your superiors adi prati roju learning e untundi and uh, most of us i will not get good bosses i think it is life you know very um, mix sometime will be encouraging sometime it will be disturbing e vachina kuda i think we have to cross those hurdles and every day it is learning every day is a learning indaka mana friend srinivas garu annattu incremental growth anedi oka shatham start aithe adi jeevithantham untund anedi plus mana studies whatever uh, is there manam prati okati enrich chestune undale mean as a balram or cmd singer ani prapanchamlo naaku 0.1 పాయింట్ ఒక్క శాతం కూడా తెలియదు ఐ మీన్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ అస్ వాడ్ వాట్ డూ ఐ నో అబౌట్ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ కంప్యూటర్ ఐ కాన్ టు అండ్ ఐ డోంట్ నో అబౌట్ ద ఆంథ్రోపాలజీ ఐ డోంట్ నో మచ్ అబౌట్ ది జియాగ్రఫీ జియో ఫిజిక్స్ స్పేస్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ ఏరోనాటిక్ ఆర్ జ్యుడిషియల్ సిస్టమ్ సో యాజ్ ఏ హ్యూమన్ బీయింగ్ వీ వీ షెల్ హ్యావ్ ది జనరల్ నాలెడ్జ్ అండ్ మోస్ట్లీ కామన్ సెన్స్ కామన్ సెన్స్ ఉన్నాక వాట్ ఎవర్ ఫీల్డ్ వి చూస్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు ఎక్సెల్ in those fields 
అండ్ తర్వాత ప్రిపేర్ అవుతూనే ఉన్నాం లక్కిలీ గాట్ ఇన్ టు సర్వీస్ అండ్ ఇందాక అన్నట్టు అగైన్ విల్ గో బ్యాక్ సో ఈ మూడు ముగ్గురు పిల్లలు ఉండి సివిల్ చదువుతాడంటే ఏ గాలిలో మేడలు కడుతున్నారు అది ఉంటారు మన దగ్గర సో గాలిలో మేడలు కడతారు అందరికి ఇట్లే బతుకుతారా అంతే కదా ప్రైవేట్ ఏదో చేసుకోవచ్చు కదా అందరూ చేస్తారా సో నానా మాటలు అండ్ ఇంకా ఏంటంటే మీ దాంట్లో ఇంజనీరింగ్ కంప్లీట్ అయినా మీరు కూడా చాలామంది గ్రూప్స్ రాయచ్చు సర్వీస్ రాయచ్చు ఇంకా కొంచెం ఫీల్డ్ పెంచుకోవచ్చు అబ్రాడ్ వెళ్తారు ఆర్ మైనింగ్ సెక్టార్ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ ఆర్ ఇన్ఫ్రాస్ట్రక్చర్ సెక్టార్ ఈరోజు అయితే భూమి ఉన్నాయో అవన్నిటి ట్రై చేస్తారు మీరు ఆ ట్రైలో ఎప్పుడు కూడా మీరు దాని ఐ మీన్ హర్డల్స్ వచ్చినప్పుడు ఏదైనా మనకు మంచి జరగాలంటే కొంత ప్రాబ్లం ఉండనే ఉంటుంది ప్రతి మనిషి జీవితంలో అది వచ్చేది దాన్ని దాటుకుంటూ రావాలా అయితే డెఫినెట్లీ మీకు సక్సెస్ అనేది వస్తుంది అండ్ చాలాసార్లు పెద్దలు కూడా చెప్పారు మనం చదివింది ఒకటి ఉంటుంది మనం చేసే పన్ను ఒకటి ఉంటుంది ఈవెన్ ఈరోజు మనకు గూగుల్ అయినా చీఫ్ అయినా మైక్రోసాఫ్ట్ అయినా ఇంకెవరైనా సో మనము చదువుకున్న చదువు ఏంటంటే బెస్ట్ డిసిషన్ సమ్ టైమ్స్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు టేక్ రిస్క్ ఇన్ లైఫ్ అదే మనకు సేవ్ అవుతుంది చాలామంది ఎవరైతే లైఫ్లో రిస్క్ తీసుకుంటారో వాళ్ళకి మంచి సక్సెస్కి వెళ్తుంటారు అది అనేక అనేక రూపాల్లో ఉండొచ్చు ఈ ఉన్న బీటెక్ని బదిలి ఎంటెక్ చేయడం కావచ్చు అబ్రాడ్ వెళ్ళడం కావచ్చు లేకుంటే ఖచ్చితంగా కఠినంగా ఒక కాంపిటేటివ్ ఎగ్జామ్ మీద కూర్చోవడం కావచ్చు ఆ ఒక ఇండస్ట్రీ ఎంటర్ప్రినర్గా కావచ్చు ఇవన్నీ కూడా కొంత రిస్క్ తీసుకొని కొంత హార్డ్ వర్క్ చేస్తే డెఫినెట్లీ మీకు సక్సెస్ కావాలా ఈరోజు మీరందరూ కూడా మీ పేరెంట్స్తో ఉన్నారు దే దే ఆర్ మోర్ హ్యాపియర్ పర్సన్ అండ్ చాలా ఆనందంగా ఉంటారు ఇంజనీరింగ్ ఇక్కడి నుంచి చేశారు కాబట్టి సో వాళ్ళ జీవితాలని వాళ్ళ ఒక బాగోగుల్ని చుట్టుపక్కల వాళ్ళని కూడా చూసుకుంటూ ఫ్యామిలీని చూసుకుంటూ ముందుకు వెళ్తారని ఆశిస్తూ మన సింగరేణి అనే సింగరేణి సంస్థకి నేను లాస్ట్ ఫైవ్ ఇయర్స్ ఐ వాజ్ డైరెక్టర్ అండ్ ఇన్ ద మంత్ ఆఫ్ జాన్వరి ఐ బికమ్ చైర్మన్ అండ్ మేనేజింగ్ డైరెక్టర్ సో దానికి కారణం ఏంటంటే డయాస్ ఉన్న టీచరు హాఫ్ ద డయాస్ ఉన్న టీచరు ఇందాక చెప్పినట్టు మై పేరెంట్స్ మై మదర్ అండ్ ఫాదర్ దే ఆర్ ఇల్లిటరేట్ వాళ్ళ చదువు గురించి చదవదు చిన్నప్పటి నుంచి పిల్లల్ని ఎంకరేజ్ చేసేది టీచర్సే వాళ్ళే మన చదువును గుర్తించి మనం బాగా వినయంగా ఉండు మంచి చదివితే వాళ్ళే గుర్తిస్తారు సో నేను సర్వీస్ వచ్చాక సర్వీస్ డెడికే డెడికేషన్ అయితే ఫస్ట్ టీచర్కి పేరెంట్ చేశాను సో టీచర్ను కూడా మనము లైఫ్ లాంగ్ గుర్తు పెట్టుకోవాలి అండ్ సింగరేణి సంస్థ అనేది మీకు తెలుసు దక్షిణ భారతదేశంలో వన్ ఆఫ్ ది బిగ్గెస్ట్ ఆర్ ప్రెస్టీజియస్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్ సౌత్ ఇండియా ద కోల్ ప్రొడక్షన్ వీఆర్ సప్లైంగ్ టు తెలంగాణ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ కర్ణాటక మహారాష్ట్ర తమిళనాడు అండ్ ఎన్టీపీసీ ఈవెన్ సమ్ వీఆర్ సప్లైంగ్ నాన్ రెగ్యులేటర్ సెక్టర్స్ ఒక పదహారు రాష్ట్రాలకు మనం సప్లై చేస్తున్నాము ఈ ఆర్గనైజేషన్లో మనము ఉన్నప్పుడు ఏం చేయాలా ఎట్లా గ్రో చేయాలా అనేది కూడా చాలా ఇంపార్టెంట్ సో ఆఫ్టర్ ఐ టుక్ ఓవర్ యాజ్ సిఎండిఎండి సో అగ్రెసివ్లీ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు సోలార్ దాకా రాజస్థాన్లో కూడా సోలార్ చేద్దామని అండ్ ఒరిస్సాలో కూడా వ్యవ స్టార్టెడ్ వన్ కోల్ బ్లాక్ అక్కడ కూడా కోల్ బ్లాక్ అక్కడ కూడా పవర్ ప్లాంట్ కట్టాలని ఆ తర్వాత న్యూ టెక్నాలజీ గ్రీన్ హైడ్రోజన్ కానీ బ్యాటరీ స్టోరేజ్ కానీ కోల్ గ్యాసిఫికేషన్ కానీ అటు పంపడ్ స్టోరేజ్ కానీ అండ్ మేకింగ్ అవర్ ఫ్రూట్ ప్రింట్ ఇన్ అబ్రాడ్ అటు ఆస్ట్రేలియా కానీ ఆఫ్రికాలో కానీ అలా కావాలి అలా సింగరేణి సంస్థ కాకుండా మన రాష్ట్రానికి దేశానికి మంచి పేరు రావాలనే ఉద్దేశంతో ఇవన్నీ కూడా ఎట్లా సాధ్యమైతే టీచర్స్ అండ్ ఆ వెలిషర్స్తో సాధ్యమైంది అందుకోసం వీఆర్ మేక్ గోయింగ్ టు మేక్ సింగరేణి ప్రౌడ్ అండ్ అండ్ సింగరేణి ఆల్సో పార్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఒక ప్రొఫెసర్ చైర్ ఒక త్రీ క్రోర్స్ మనము ఉస్మానికి హెల్ప్ చేసి ఉన్నాము సో ఐ ఫీల్ ప్రౌడ్ ఆ తర్వాత ఇంకో బిల్డింగ్కి ఫిఫ్టీ ల్యాక్స్ ఇచ్చాము సో ఈ విధంగా అండ్ ఇద్దరు మన ఆఫీసర్స్ని ఆఫీసర్ని దే ఆర్ ద ప్రొఫెసర్స్ ఇన్ మైనింగ్ డిసిప్లిన్ అండ్ సో మీరు కూడా మీరు కూడా మీ 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 భవిష్యత్తులో మీ 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 ఉద్యోగ బాధ్యతల్లో నిర్వర్తిస్తూ ఫస్ట్ పేరెంట్స్కి టీచర్స్కి మన సొసైటీకి ఆ తర్వాత మీరు పనిచేసే ఆర్గనైజేషన్కి గొప్ప పేరు తెస్తారని భావిస్తూ నా అవకాశం ఇచ్చిన ఓయూ ఇంజనీరింగ్ కాలేజీ వారికి ధన్యవాదాలు థ్యాంక్ యూ సో మచ్ ఆన్ బిహాఫ్ ఆఫ్ ద గ్రాడ్యుయేటింగ్ క్లాస్ విత్ ఎ బిగ్ రౌండ్ ఆఫ్ అప్లాస్ వీ వుడ్ లైక్ టు థ్యాంక్ థ్యాంక్ యూ సో ఫర్ యువర్ ప్రెజెన్స్ అండ్ ఫర్ షేరింగ్ యువర్ వాల్యుబుల్ మెమరీస్ ఐ ఫీల్ హానర్ టు ఇన్వైట్ ద
Namaskaram to everyone. Respected degrees on the dais. Today's chief guest, Sri N. Balram Garu, IRS Chairman Managing Director, Singareni Colorways Company Limited, Hyderabad, Telangana. Today's guest of honor and uh, Sri Gopal T. K. Krishna Garu, founder and president of Krishna Engineering Consultants, Iowa State, and also is uh, receiving a distinguished alumni award from the University College of Engineering. Congratulations, sir, for receiving the distinguished alumni of the Usman University Engineering College. And uh, the guest of honor, Sri Srinivas Kukumanugaru, Managing Director and CEO, Moss Chip Technologies, Hyderabad. Professor Chandrasekhar, Principal, University College of Engineering. Professor Krishnaya, SIDAC Director, Professor Narsimulu Sanke, Director of Evaluation Examination Cell, Usman University Engineering College, and Dr. D. Vijay Kumar, President, University College of Engineering Alumni Association, Usman University, and Dignity of the Das, Professor Baburao Garu, our Civil Engineering Retired Professor, and Ramohan Garu former president of alumni association and our OSD Garu, Professor Rede Nayak, OSD to Vice Chancellor Usman City, Satish Nayak Garu and the Chief Engineer Radhika Garu, all the adult departments of various departments of engineering college, chairpersons of various departments of engineering college, professors, associate professors and assistant professors and distinguished chairpersons, chair professors of mining engineering department, dear pair, expected parents, dear students, present media, ladies and gentlemen, namaskaram to once again all of you. I am very happy to be here today to participate in the graduation day 2024 of University College of Engineering Usman University. First of all, I would like to congratulate all the gold medal winners rank holders and the cash award winners from the engineering college and also I congratulate and thanks the respected teachers who molded them to win the gold medal and also win the cash medals and the rankers become a ranker. I think this is because of the your parental suggestions, guidance and the mentorship of the Teachers of the Engineering College of Small City, your seniors, and also mainly all I'm requesting or instructing all the students, please you have to thank all the supporting staff of the engineering college, especially who have work, worked in the laboratories, have who cleaned your classrooms, scavengers, attenders, watchmen, and all the people you have to thank them because they serve for four years in a directly or indirectly to become up to this stage. And also I congratulate the or thanks the all the gold medal instituted by the old alumni of the or various people of the society. I thanks them for instituting the gold medals in various departments of the University College of Engineering. Especially, I think uh, already seniors have uh, it told a lot of things. You learn, don't focus on more on learning, but you have to focus on learning only. So keep learning, don't forget about it. Like Balram Gauri told that his experience mainly, you have to see that he is a 12th failed. There was a movie also, it has come, it has come 12th failed movie. I am requesting all of you can see that once again. So he is a role model for us today. Because 12th fail and child marriage also his parents are fo forcibly or fortunately or unfortunately <laughs> they arranged a marriage for him as a minor. But those days I don't know but he knows about the law of minor marriages are illegal. But otherwise, he could, could have been in jail. <laughs> but luckily, he was concentrated on learning. 
one or other intermediate and distance mode degree and PG and uh, M field degree. Sir, we are very happy you are alumni of Usman City. But the Usmaniers are always there, they are the leaders. If they, they keep on studying it, they keep on learning in different things, in different ways. They can learn from the academics, they can learn from the student teachers, they can learn from their peer group, and uh, they also they learn from the societal things also. If they are studying or entering into the Usman City itself, it shows them a good path because here there are, we observe that so many agitations, boycotts, and uh, even fightings. So those things, what to do, how to do, what is correct, what should be learned out of that. So for the, basically, it is taught by the Usman City campus to the every graduate or every student who joined in the Usman City. When he's going out of the university, definitely they are the leaders in their chosen field. They are the leaders and they are the leaders. They may be the leader, they should be the leaders in the society. So with these uh, remarks, and the Usman City is also, we focus a lot of things on the Usman City campus because many graduates, they can study, any graduate actually, they can study any post-graduation degree, especially in the Faculty of Arts, Faculty of Social Science, and the Faculty of Fata, Faculty of Management. All the engineering graduates, they can enter into that, they can do their higher education. If they want to go abroad, that is a different, you can choose your career in different subjects, you can improve your academic careers and academic growth. And also, Usman City started a civil service academy and this year, I think many graduates are appeared for the group one and they are appearing for the main exams of the group one. So I am requesting the engineering graduates also, please concentrate on not only the software jobs, concentrate on the civil services or societal how to enter it like Balram Garu he entered into the service or service courses service uh, career so I'm requesting all of you please concentrate that side also so because you are going only one side and going abroad if you can go into abroad take as a role model Sri Gopal Krishna Garu because he became as a leader in his chosen field but Gopal Krishna Garu is uh, sponsoring uh, 5 crore rupees to the electrical engineering department to construct the building on his teacher's name that is Professor Narsimha's name is contributing it it means so how much he learned from the teachers that is a gratitude so the same spirit I am requesting the current stu outgoing students also or present students also please think about it and Concentrate that what you have learned from the institution, how you are going to help the society by service or by contributing it or giving back to the society. I think even Sinas Kar also is giving, contributing under CSR funds to the electrical, electronics and communication engineering. Thank you, sir. This is coming up forward. It may be a good motivation for the outgoing students, not only the immediately after 10 years or 15 years or 20 years. Once you settle, please keep coming every year or whenever you are coming to the campus, please respect the departments you have to uh, visit and interact with the present students, interact with your teachers, that may be more helpful. And also thanks the uh, CMD Singarani Companies Calories Limited, Balram Garu, he gave really, he is uh, really sponsoring the teachers for the mining engineering. Because of the Singarani calories only, company calories only, we are running that mining engineering department. He sponsored the three teachers fully paid by the Singarani only. And also one professor chair. Sir, really we are very happy for that. But still, sir is sponsored for two crores for the electronics and communication engineering department classroom for the ground floor and the first floor. There is a one more floor is also required, sir. That. For that, we hope you are... Uh, some more contribution, but we may not ask that. I know about uh, Singarani Calories, how much they are helping to the Usman City. I think in the Singarani Calories, majority of the graduates are studied under the Usman City. So it is our, as a Usman City company is the mainly the Singarani company is almost nothing but a Usman City company. So sir, we are requesting that. Please concentrate and think about it. I think our teachers and our graduates they are working in the Singarani calories. 
and also I'm requesting that possible if you can add or contribute to the academic side also some more chair professors in the new courses are added into that one is a computer science artificial intelligence and machine learning in the new courses introduced it and some more courses are also added in the biomedical side presently biomedical side some medical and biological students are also taking admission in the biomedical engineering so it is a multidisciplinary students are entering into the usmana engineering college in various departments especially biomedical and the computer science and ma arts ma courses and social science especially economics public art political science social science sociology so even in the future the university is thinking about that even science side also they may enter into that like in the foreign universities how they are giving an opportunity to improve their higher education in the various faculties the usman city is also thinking in, in this direction with these few words once again i congratulate the all the medal winners and crash crash prize winners and the rankers and the outgoing students of the university college of engineering usman city thank you thank you very much for giving this opportunity Thank you sir for your inspiring and thoughtful remarks your words have offered valuable reflections for our graduates as they embark on their new journeys as we continue our celebration we come to a highlight of today's ceremony the presentation of the distinguished alumnus award today we are honored to present this award to shri gopal tk krishna garu whose remarkable accomplishments and dedication have brought great pride to our alma mater and his recent generosity truly marked a significant milestone in a way to transform the landscape of our electrical engineering department and has a remarkable impact on our academic community ladies and gentlemen please join me in welcoming shri gopal tk krishna garu be triple class of 1968 founder and president krishna engineering consultants usa to receive the distinguished alumnus award it is my proud privilege and honor to read the citations of today's distinguished alumnus award of usman university college of engineering for the year 2023-24 uh, shri gopal tk krishna iowa state usa university college of engineering usman university hyderabad presents distinguished alumnus award to shri gopal tk krishna university college of engineering usman university is recognized as one of the centers of academic excellence the students graduating from this prestigious institute 
or of the highest caliber who have reached the positions of eminence in various government sectors, industry, academic and research institutions and also business. By conformment of the Distinguished Alumnus Award, the University University in 1982. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna's academic achievements reflect his unwavering commitment to lifelong learning and serve as an inspiration to younger generations. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna holds formal registrations as a licensed professional engineer in Iowa State, Minnesota, Missouri, Nebraska and Wisconsin and is a certified power quality professional with the Association of Energy Engineers reflecting his extensive capabilities. The Outstanding Young Engineer Award conferred upon him in 1979 by the Central Iowa Chapter of the Iowa Engineering Society. The John Dunlop Sherman Woodward Award for Outstanding Technical and Professional Achievement before the age of 35 awarded in 1979 by the Iowa Engineering Society and the Outstanding Minority Entrepreneur of 1981 Award from the Minority Business Association all recognize his significant contributions to his professional career. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna's publications include writing electrical specifications published in Electrical Construction and Maintenance magazine in May 1976, sequencing batch reactors for activated sludge treatment presented at the 19th annual ASCE Water Resources Design Conference in February 1981, and non-sanitary engineering features can help ensure a plant success published in Water Engineering and Management magazine in October 1987. These works remain a valuable source of knowledge. He worked for Winstra and Kim Inc. from 1970 to 1980 before founding his own firm that is Krishna Engineering Consultants Inc. in 1980. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna and his firm have received numerous professional and project awards. He remains actively engaged in his work and aspires to continue for many more years. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna's accomplishments extend beyond technical and professional organizations into the realm of politics. He won 1740 elections and never lost even a single election. He was the first Indian American to get elected as a delegate to his party's national convention in 1988 and first Indian American to get elected to many party positions at the state level. He served as treasurer of the party twice and as state co-chair for an unpre unprecedented four times terms as an elected delegate to the National Convention and the National Platform Committee in 2012. He personally changed the national manifesto of his party in favor of India. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna and his wife Srimati Rajkumari Krishna joyously celebrated their 50th wedding anniversary on July 1, 2024. They are also, they are blessed with three sons, two grandsons and four granddaughters. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishna, Sir, you are 
assuredly a great motivation for alumni out there in providing your gratitude towards the college you have graduated from this institution your generous thought and commitment to, to sponsor a new building for your parent department department of electrical engineering and your intention to name the building after your professor professor y narsimhan is an ever inspiring noble contribution as you always mention the primary motivation for this great gesture inspired by your by the values instilled in you by your parents shri tk srinivas acharya and shrimati tk rajamal who taught you guru brahma guru vishnu guru devo maheshwara guru shakshat par brahma tasmay shri guruve namaha they would certainly be the happiest souls because of your ever kind actions in recognitions of shri gopal tk krishna's outstanding contributions in the field of electrical engineering his success as an entrepreneur and politician and his remarkable generously in contributing towards the new electrical engineering department building that is professor y narsimhan building university college of engineering usmani university he is truly proud to confer on him this distinguished alumnus award 2023-24 thank you sir to capture this to capture the special occasion i kindly request all the esteemed faculty of electrical engineering department to please come forward and join us on the dais for a group photo A heartfelt thank you to all our esteemed dignitaries on the dais for the gracious participation in presenting the distinguished alumnus award. Now we have the pleasure of hearing from our distinguished alumnus awardee. I now invite Sri Gopal T K Krishna Garu to address the august gathering. Let's listen and be ready to embrace the knowledge and wisdom he shares. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming Sir with a warm round of applause. um first thing i want to say is thank you for all the decision makers and all the people who are involved in giving this award to me and um i would like your permission to dedicate this award to my parents my school teachers my school teachers and uh, my lab personnel when i was here in the engineering department and to all the professors in the usman university in my electrical engineering department who educated me and guided me to become what i am today so i'm grateful to all of them and i want to dedicate this award to all of them i'm glad that balram garu 
accepted the invitation to come here because Balramal Garu Achar Gavati, Krishna Garu Garu Achar. And um, I want to let all the students who are graduating today to tell them that this is not my day, this is your day. This is the day for all of you to rejoice and enjoy the graduating degree that you're going to get. And um, all of you have worked so hard to receive these degrees today. Now tomorrow brings uncertainty, apprehension, fear as to what is going to happen next. I want to assure you I was in the same position like you. When all these people said that they graduated in 1990 and 1995, and my graduation year is so small, 1968, I felt they're all my seniors because their numbers are higher than me. Then I figured out how to beat them. So I thought I will join you who are graduating today. Uh, it's a special day for me also because I never had a graduation day when I graduated from Usman University. I thought they didn't give me the degree because I owe them money for all the things that I broke in the lab or other destruction that I might have caused. But I realized that they didn't give me any graduation day in 1968 because of the Telangana agitation. So I'm joining you today along with you. I'm also graduating. So since I'm graduating in 2024, now I'm senior to all of them, right? Because my number has gone up from 1968 to 2024. So they cannot claim a seniority over me just because they graduated in 1990 or 1995. I want all the students to understand that I was like you and I had no idea what I was going to do after the graduation. But believe me, your God will guide you in the path where your destiny is. And trust, trust me, you will achieve all the things you are capable of. Every student has a special talent. They will find out what their talent is. And they will work hard to improve that talent and achieve the best in their field. As soon as you achieve all the things that you do, think about all the people that helped you to achieve that. Today, after graduation, all the students should talk to their parents and all the people who are involved in their lives to who helped them to graduate today and say thank you. Because without them, you would not have been able to graduate. Now, as you progress in the next stage of life, you will come across a lot of difficulties. But remember that God created sun to dispel the darkness of the night. Just like that, you will also will overcome all those difficulties and proceed further. But never forget the parents, the siblings, and everybody who helped you to achieve what you are. So help them first and then understand that you have to provide for your spouse and children. Now, traditionally, when we say you have to provide for your spouse and children, it meant that man has to provide for it. But now things have changed. The women engineers are going to provide for the men engineers, and that will be the trend in the future. So all the men should be better careful with all the women who are graduating today because they are going to provide for you. They will be the spouse and the children. Eventually, as you fulfill all the responsibilities of your life, think about all the professors, all the people who helped you in educating you, come back to this university just like I did and tell them thank you and do everything possible 
and I'm sure all of you together will construct many more buildings in this campus in the, in the, in the name of all your favorite professors. And I'm just starting the trend and I'm just inspiring all of you to do much more better than me. You are all capable of achieving a lot more than I did. And I want to wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Your contribution has added a significant value, not only to electrical engineering department, even to the college. We are deeply grateful for the time and effort you have dedicated to make this event special. Let us now proceed with the most awaited part of the today's ceremony, the presentation of gold medals. I cordially invite Senior Professor A. Krishnaya, sir, Director CDAC, University College of Engineering, Usman University, to announce the gold medal awards. I request the awardee students, please form a line. I also request all the dignitaries so to please come forward and to present the gold medals. Good evening, everyone. Distinguished guest on the dais and off the dais and uh, dear students and the parents. And uh, first let me congratulate all the medal winners and also the rank holders and prize winners. And uh, now I call uh, department wise starting from civil engineering department and before that the B overall excellency awards and uh, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, electronics engineering, biomedical engineering and computer science engineering. BE overall excellence award goes to A. Akila, Anumala Akila. He is from BE CSE, has secured following three gold medals, starting from Dr. B. R. Ambedkar gold medal to be awarded to BE student who secured highest aggregate marks among all the branches. This gold medal is constituted by Professor Papula Lakshmarayana and his family. And I request uh, Chief Guest to present this gold medal. And also second gold medal, see Sandeep Sharma and Srimati Surabhi Sharma gold medal to be awarded to BE all round excellence cur current five year student of UCEOU. And the third gold medal, OUCE CAC alumni gold medal to be awarded to first rank students of BE Computer Science and Engineering. Now the Civil Engineering Department, Biravalli Amoga, is the BE Civil as secured following three gold medals. The first one, C. K. Ramasamy gold medal to be awarded to first rank student of BE Civil Engineering. The second gold medal, MC Consulting Engineering Private Limited gold medal to be awarded to best outgoing student of BE Civil Engineering. The third one, C. Maram Raju Narsimara gold medal to be awarded to who secured the highest marks in transportation subject in BE Civil Engineering. The continuation of civil engineering, Bandari Sai Manasa from BE Civil has secured following four gold medals. <laughs> Professor Vaikuntam gold medal to be awarded to best outgoing student who secured highest aggregate marks of BE Civil Engineering. The second one, late Sri Karamchat Srinivasalo, OU Civil Alumnus of OUCE 98, uh, 86 gold medal to be awarded to overall Topper in core subjects of BE Civil Engineering. The third one, Sri Bundugula Narsimharet gold medal to be awarded to the student whose parental income is least among the outgoing top 10 rankers of the BE Civil Engineering. The fourth one, late Sri 
Binjamur Raghavan gold medal to be awarded to topper uh, topper girl student who secured highest aggregate marks in civil engineering, graphics or drawing, including AutoCAD, survey, theory and practicals, estimation costing and specifications, and construction engineering and management of B civil engineering. The next Let's see, Benjamin Raghavan gold medal to be awarded to topper boy student who secured highest aggregate marks in civil engineering, a graphics or drawing including AutoCAD, survey, theory and practicals, estimation and costing and specifications, and construction engineering and management. That goes to C.H. Sai Prashetan. Now coming to mechanical engineering, personal to Monica, she secured three gold medals, BA mechanical engineering, Monica, P. Monica, Professor Abhidali gold medal to be awarded to first rank student of BA mechanical engineering, let's see, Sripati uh, Parvatredi retired Tasildar Memorial Gold Medal to be awarded to top ranker among the girl students of BE Mechanical Engineering. And third one is Srimati Sheikh Fatima B Gold Medal to be awarded to outgoing minority student among top 10 rankers of BE Mechanical Engineering. If not available, then best outgoing first rank students. Then coming to electrical, electrical and electronics engineering, D. Srija is a BE Tbilisi has secured the following four gold medals: 1978-79 electrical engineering batch alumni gold medal to be awarded to first rank student of BE electrical and electronics engineering. The second one, Sri Niravetla Damodaradi gold medal to be awarded to first rank students of BE electrical and electronics engineering. Kola Savanti, Sri Pantul Pandare gold medal to be awarded to best outgoing student whose parental income is least among the top 10 rankers of the BE electrical and electronics engineering. Please come. Kola Savanti, I request the raise just a Congratulations to his father. Pantanu Pandari government to be awarded to best outgoing students whose parental income is least among the top 10 rankers of BE Electrical and Electronics Engineering, Kola Savanti. I request uh, research to present the gold medal. Now we will move to Electronics and Communication Engineering. D. Abhigna, this award is uh, constructed by Eliko DVS Raju Gold Medal to be awarded to first rank students of BE Electronics and Communication Engineering. I request the Srinivasal to present this gold medal. And, this, and uh, next candidate, Mola Anusha. This gold medal is considered by Sri Late Kirti Kirti Soft Gold Medal to be awarded to student who 
has the least parental income among the top 10 rankers of the BE Electronics and Communication Engineering. I request the registrar to present this gold medal. Next to move into Biomedical Engineering. The Biomedical Institution Center gold medal to be awarded to first rank students of BE Biomedical Engineering. Rupika Jain. Now the next one is the Computer Science and Engineering. Let's see Pendala Srinivas gold medal to be awarded to Topper in Data Structures, BV Computer Science and Engineering. This goes to B. Akshita Reddy. The next one, Srimati Pendala Vijaya Srinivas, wife of Let's see P. Srinivas gold medal to be awarded to overall Topper who secured highest aggregate marks in mathematics among all the branches. G. Banu Prakash is from CSE department. Banu Prakash. Banu Prakash is not there. Okay, we'll move to next. Let E. E. Srinivas gold medal to be awarded to B. Computer Science and Engineering. The first year topper for the academic year 22 23. This goes to Mohammed Mustafa Khan, the B computer science student. Sri Chella Rajendra Prasad, the overall best student of the college. It is a cash award of rupees 40,000. It goes to Ruchita. Munagala from Biomedical Engineering Department. It is a cash award of 40,000 rupees. Considered by Challa Rajendra Prasad. Thank you all. Thank you all the dignitaries and all the uh, what's up? Prize winners, once again, congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you, Professor Krishnaya, sir, for announcing the gold medals. Let us once again have a big round of applause to all the gold medal winners for their outstanding achievements. Congratulations to all the gold medal winners on your incredible success. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are delighted to begin the distribution of department-wise rank certificates and cash awards. These certificates and awards mark a significant milestone in our students' academic journey. Firstly, I request Head Department of Civil Engineering, Prof. P. Rashekar Garu to announce the rank certificate and cash awards of the department. Good evening to all the esteemed members present here, please. It's a pleasure to announce the rank certificates pertaining to the Department of Civil Engineering. The first rank goes to B. Amogha. B. Amogha, first rank. Second rank goes to B. Saimansa. B. Saimansa, please come. Saimansa was here just now. She received gold medal, please. Third, third rank goes to G. Navya. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Now I request Head Department of Mechanical Engineering, Professor Chandrasekhar, sir.
very good evening to all. Now I call upon rank certificate holders. First rank of mechanical engineering department, Fasinati Monica. Second rank, Karre Vivek. Third rank, Tinchala Pawan Kalyan. Again, third rank goes to two students. Take a matter of please. Next cash awards, Professor Abidali Memorial Scholarship of Rupees 50,000, each to be awarded to a meritorious student of first year ME Mechanical Engineering of the following specializations, ME Production Engineering, Tejavatus Neha. <laughs> ME Automation and Robotics, Gaddam Upendra. Yes. M.E. Turbo Missionary, Kodurupaka Sai Kumar. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Now I request Head Department of Electrical Engineering, Professor E. Vidya Sagar Garu, to announce the rank certificate and cash awards of that department. Good evening. Now I announce the rank certificates and cash awards in Electrical Engineering Department. Rank certificates, Mr. Ms. D. Srija, first rank. Fine, thank you. Second rank, Miss Ifra Ayman. Now again, second rank, Miss G. Kiran Mai. Third rank, Miss Sadwani Chiguru Mamidi. Now, Cash Awards. Alumni 1979-83 batch electrical engineering cash award of rupees 8,000 to be awarded to Second and third overall toppers of BE Electrical and Electronics Engineering, Miss Ifra Ayman, second rank. Miss G. Kiranmai, second rank.
మిస్ సద్వాని చిగురు మామిడి థర్డ్ ర్యాంక్ ప్రొఫెసర్ ఏవిఆర్ఎస్ శర్మ అండ్ శ్రీ ఏ సూర్యనారాయణ మూర్తి క్యాష్ అవార్డ్ ఆఫ్ రూపీస్ ఫైవ్ థౌసండ్ టు బి అవార్డెడ్ టు స్టూడెంట్ హూ సెక్యూర్డ్ హయ్యెస్ట్ అగ్రిగేట్ మార్క్స్ ఇన్ మ్యాథమెటిక్స్ దట్ ఈస్ మిస్ బి సాయి ప్రసన్న శ్రీమతి ఉత్పల్ శర్మ మదర్ ఆఫ్ ప్రొఫెసర్ ధన్వంతరి క్యాష్ అవార్డ్ ఆఫ్ రూపీస్ ఎయిట్ థౌసండ్ టు బి అవార్డెడ్ టు బెస్ట్ ప్రాజెక్ట్ ఆఫ్ బిఇ ఎలక్ట్రికల్ అండ్ ఎలక్ట్రానిక్స్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ మిస్టర్ శ్రీ చరణ్ ఏ మిస్ డి శ్రీజ మిస్టర్ గోలి నాగవర్ధన్ మిస్ ఇఫ్రా ఐమన్ next the electrical engineering uh, all rounder uh, award specifically showcasing leadership skills goes that is the t sridhar memorial award instituted by their batchmates the classmates of 8286 the winner is chanda joshit i request the batchmates also to please come on to the dais Thank you, sir. Now I invite Head, Department of ECE, Professor D. Ramakrishna to announce the rank certificates and cash awards. Yeah. Good evening. Um, now I will call upon uh, rank certificate holders from Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering. First rank goes to Boddu Abhigna. Second rank, Janabi Gadam. Third rank, Devala Sravani. Coming to Cash Awards, Prof. B.M. Pandari Pandey Cash Award of Rs. 6,718 to be awarded to the best outgoing girl student of BE Electronics and Communication Engineering goes to Bodu Abhigna. late sri venkateshwar rao shamapant and sushila bai scholarship um, of rupees 15000 to be awarded to sri vaibhav ladda 
present BEC seven semester student. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Now I request Professor M. Malini Garu, Head Department of Biomedical Engineering, to announce rank certificates and cash awards for their department graduates. The first rank from Biomedical Engineering for the class of 2024 is backed by Ms. Ritika Jain. Ms. Dudala Divya Sri has backed the second rank. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma'am. Now I invite Head Department of CSC, Professor P. Sudha, ma'am, to announce the awards. A very good evening to one and all. It's an honor to be among such stars here. So the first rank is backed by Anumala Akhila from Computer Science and Engineering. Congratulations. Please come over. Now I call upon Mr. B. Vamshavardhan Reddy for the second rank. Congrats. So hearty congratulations to the third rank holder, Rayabharpu Gayatri. Now over to the cash awards, Meenakshi Balan and Krishna Swami Balan cash award of rupees 9000 for overall academic excellence in computer science, Anumal Akhila, once again. Yes. Yeah, in continuation to the goal, uh, the award winners, now I call upon Srimati Pendyala Vijaya Srinivas, wife of late Sri P. Srinivas, Srinivas Rao gold medal to be awarded to overall topper who secured highest aggregate marks in mathematics among all branches, Gadela Bhanu Prakash from CSE. Hearty congratulations to all the students who are passing out and all the winners. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, congratulations to each and every one of you and look forward to seeing all the great things you will achieve in the future. Moving on, now we have distribution of department-wise provisional certificates to our successful graduates from the academic year 2023 to 2024. These certificates represent the culmination of years of hard work, dedication and perseverance. Now I call upon Chairman Board of Studies, Department of Civil Engineering, Professor K. Shashigant Garu to announce the names of the students receiving the undergraduate certificates.
Uh, sure. Thank you, sir. Thank you, madam. Uh, I'll call upon the names of the students of the successful uh, graduating students. Congratulations to civil batch students. Now I'm calling the names as per the rule number. Please be calm as per the rule number. Uh, Akshar, please come first. Namrata. Bhandari Sai Manasa. Bandisri Nandini. Banot Balakrishna. Srinath, Srinath, Chintapandu Sai Prachetan, D. Manvita, Akkad Faslina, Vijaya Lakshmi, Navya G Navya Vaishnavi Sai Prasanna Gummadi Srinivasulu Rohit Sagar Rohit, Rohit, 23, 24, Bhargav, rule number 26, Siri Meghana, Roll number 30, Kalpana, 33, Malot Shiva, 34, Mahmud Sanim Afan, correct, no? Fast, fast. Rule number 37, Nasreen Begum.
रोल नंबर थर्टी नाइन पटनम हरीश्वरी रोल नंबर फोर्टी पी विनीत रोल नंबर फोर्टी थ्री अच्छे से अच्छे से रोल नंबर फोर्टी थ्री पी रमिया रोल नंबर फोर्टी फाइव श्रीया भानु फोर्टी फाइव फोर्टी सेवन सिरीशा फोर्टी नाइन साई ऋषिकेश रूल नंबर फिफ्टी वन जिला फिफ्टी वन कदम वैष्णवी फिफ्टी थ्री पद्मजा फिफ्टी फोर वि नीरजा फिफ्टी फाइव साई भवानी एटी वन अखिला एटी टू अमोघा थैंक यू Thank you, sir. Now I call upon Chairperson Board of Studies, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Professor Narsimulu Sanke, sir, to announce the student names. Okay. Uh, roll number one, Alanka Dundi Ganesh. Roll number two, Himani Siddharth. Roll number three, Badavat Ramya Sri. Seven, Cheraka Aditya. Eight, C H Monika. Nine, D Deepthi. Ten, D Pooja. Twelve, E Amita Reddy. Thirteen, G Pawan. Fourteen, G Shashank Reddy. Fifteen, Likita Sri. Sixteen, G Sai Simant. Eighteen, G Sai Likita. Nineteen, G Vijay Paul Reddy. Twenty, G Shivani. Twenty-one, G Tejeshri. Twenty-four, Ismail Mahmud. Twenty, six. Twenty-six, K Sri Gana Ragav. Twenty-seven, K Kirthana Reddy. Twenty-eight, Lakshmi Ashwant. Vinay Ledu, kada Shyam Ledu, Srinath. Vinay Ledu, kada Vinay Shyam. इकड़ फास्ट फास्ट ट्वेंटी सिक्स ट्वेंटी सिक्स Next, thirty-one. Miss, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Lady. Thirty-one. K. Srinidhi. Thirty-two. Shrujan. K. Shrujan. 
थर्टी फोर आश्रिया थर्टी सेवन चंदना फोर्टी वन अनुन रे अनुन फोर्टी टू लक्ष्मण फोर्टी टू फोर्टी थ्री जी श्रावणी फोर्टी फोर सूर्यदेवर वेंकट निधिनाथ फोर्टी फाइव फोर्टी फाइव टी श्री श्रीकांत फोर्टी सिक्स फोर्टी सिक्स यू शिव प्रणीत फोर्टी एट मिस फोर्टी एट क्या प्योर फोर्टी एट फोर्टी एट वी साई सतोष प्रणीत एटी थ्री ई सतोषिनी एटी फोर जी वेंकटेश डायरेक्ट फाइव फाइव ओके एटी फाइव के रोहित एटी सिक्स के विवेक एटी सेवन एम मोहन एटी एट अनिरुद्ध एटी नाइन एम जगदीश्वरी नाइंटी मोहम्मद आरिफ नाइंटी वन पी मोनिका नाइंटी टू पी पवन कुमार पवन कल्याण नाइंटी थ्री नाइंटी थ्री ये शिवा 94 एस अक्षिता 95 टी आदित्य वर्धन हेलो मा नाइंटी सिक्स टी रोशनी नाइंटी सेवन वै एवीएस कृष्ण नाइंटी एट वै चंद्रशेखर नायुड़ नाइंटी नईन बी रेशमा electrical electrical sir may now invite chairperson board of studies department of electrical engineering dr n sushila to announce the student names i feel glad to call upon the electrical engineering students to receive the certificates A Grishma, K Ankita, Aradhana Rani, A Charan, B Shiva. Okay. B Prashanti, B Sai Prasanna. B Hasini Sigda, C Bharati, C Sharan, D Srija, 
जी विघ्नेश कुमार जी किरण सी नागवर्धन वासु विवेक वर्धन हरिणी जोशी इफ्रा आयमन कोट श्रीनिवासराव के श्री वैष्णवी के श्रीलता एम ऐश्वर्या एम पूर्ण साई एम कार्तिकेय एम संतोषी एम गुरुचरण मोहम्मद काशिफ फहीद श्रवंती पी लया पी विघ्नेश प्रतीक कल्याण राठौड़ अजय टी काव्या टी श्रावणी वी साई प्रणीत वाई श्रीधर ए निखिता बी गौतम राज बी लिखिता जी किरण मई के तरुण पी प्रणय कुमार पी अभिनय एस श्रावणी सी सद्वानी साई चंदर रेड्डी वी लायश्री वी निहारिका हार्टी कंग्रेचुलेशन टू एवरी वन now i invite professor p koti lakshmi chairperson board of studies department of ece to announce the students names ah come ec good evening to all now i call upon the students from ec department roll number 1 a pravina a rakesh 
ए श्री मनीष रेड्डी वाजिद बी मनोहर बी सुमंत राज डी शशांक राज डी श्रा शर्वाणी डी पवन कुमार डी वैष्णवी डी वेणु ई श्रेया जी श्रीद्युति श्रीद्युति जी श्रीद्युति जी जाह्नवी जे यशवंत चंद्र के शिशिरा के कार्तिक निखिल पवन नायक के रवलिका एम अनुषा एन राहुल तेज पी जॉय श्रेया पी विघ्ना प्रिंस आर्य नादेला ऋत्विक अग्रवाल मोहम्मद फरहान एस कौशिक एस निखिल टी वर्षिका वी साई चंद्रा वी शिवा कीर्तिवर्धिनी वी तेज रूप अब्दुल सलाम ए वनीषा साई सात्विक बी अना रिब्लिन बी महेश बी अभिज्ञा सी भानु प्रकाश ई ओम प्रिया जी हर्षिता जी हारिका जी नवीन थैंक यू ऑल मे आई नाउ कॉल अपॉन डॉक्टर जी श्रवण्या चेयर चेयरपर्सन बोर्ड ऑफ स्टडीज डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बायोमेडिकल इंजीनियरिंग टू अनाउंस द नेम्स ऑफ रिसिपियंट्स ऑफ अंडर ग्रेजुएट सर्टिफिकेट्स थैंक यू मैम Uh, on the behalf of Department of Biomedical Engineering, I would like to congratulate all the students and uh, wish you them a very good luck. So, roll number one, Ajmi. Roll number one, Ajmira Rahul Nayak. Roll number two, Bandi Akshita. Roll number three, Sarayu. Sharanya. Priyanka. दिव्य श्री दिव्य श्री चंदना कोना दिव्या रानी मदसु विनीषा मेकल श्रीमंतराज मुड़गु संदीप रुचिता हिमवर्षिनी ब्रह्मेश्वरी 
రాయల శ్వేత రేగుల సృజన రేణు రితికా జైన్ సాయి కిరణ్ జశ్వంత్ కుమార్ తానియా షిరీన్ అభిరామ్ రేతిక్ అనంత సాయి జాన్వి శ్రీ రేవంత్ కుమార్ కేశవ అభిల అభయలక్ష్మి పూజిత సూరారం మహేష్ థ్యాంక్ యూ ఆల్ ఐ నౌ ఇన్వైట్ ప్రొఫెసర్ పి సుధా మేడం ఆన్ బిహాఫ్ ఆఫ్ చైర్పర్సన్ బోర్డ్ ఆఫ్ స్టడీస్ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ ఆఫ్ సిఎస్ఈ టు అనౌన్స్ ద నేమ్స్ Yeah, from the Department of Computer Science and Engineering, Ananya Bompalli, Anjali Bhargav, B. Vamsavardhan Reddy, Babula Nagakshita, Bandari Rajashri, Bandi Rajashri. Biravalli Ajay Kumar, బీరవల్లి అజయ్ కుమార్ బుడిగే సాయి వర్షిత్ చెన్న శ్రావ్య చించెట్టి శ్రీనివాస్ చరంజిత్ చరంజితేజ చరణ్ తేజ దొంతిల భాను సుమంత్ దుస్స వంశీకృష్ణ ఎనుగుల అఖిల గడ్డీల భానుప్రకాష్ గొట్టమె గొట్టమెక్కుల సాత్విక గుగులోత్ హేమంత్ జూలూర్ ఆర్తి వందన లింగముల్ల అనుదీప్ రెడ్డి లుబ్నా అహ్మద్ జలాల్ ఎం లిఖిత లిఖిత్ రెడ్డి మచ్చ సాయి తేజస్వి మల్లెల వరుణ్ తేజ మన్నే స్పందన మారేపల్లి సూరజ్ కుమార్ మల్లేటి మర్సి సరోజ పాపిశెట్టి వెంకట యశ్వంత్ పాపిశెట్ట వెంకట యశ్వంత్ కుమార్ రాథోడ్ గోదావరి రాయబర్పు గాయత్రి రితేష్ చింతకి చింతకిండి రోహిత్ వర్ధన్ బట్టుల శంకురి సూర్య తేజ సిద్ధార్థ్ వత్య నరేష్ వంగ సుజీత్ రెడ్డి హర్కంత్ మగోత్రా మొహమ్మద్ అబ్దుల్ రహమాన్
श्रीजा राव मलपोर टू इशाक मुस्तफा खान गुडलोंडा निखिल रोनित पॉल बाइक्र साई विकास बंडी सुप्रिया बिजगिरी अमूल्या या नेक्स्ट बोडू मेघना चरकमान खुशी चौरे कौशिक गडमीडी सुषमा कले प्रियंका कुतड़ी चरण मदगौनी वरुण तेज गौड मोहम्मद बिलाल एन विजय साई संतोषी नूने पूजिता पंडुग भाविता कंग्रेट्स पोतराजु भास्कर रल्लबंडि नवीन कुमार रंगराजु कीर्तन समरीन सीलमंत भार्गवी तन्नेरु रेवंत कुमार तुपरी प्रणय वि साकेत रेड्डी वडी कीर्तन के गंगा भवानी That's all. Congratulations to all. Moving on, as a token of gratitude, let us proceed for the presentation of mementos to all the esteemed dignitaries on the desk. Let us proceed for the presentation of mementos to all the esteemed dignitaries on the desk. I humbly request Professor P. Lakshminarayanagaru, Registrar, Usmania University and President of today's function, 
to present a memento to the chief guest sri n balram garu irs chairman and managing director singareni colonies company limited hyderabad as a symbol of gratitude and respect I humbly request Prof. P. Lakshmanarayana Garu, Registrar Usmania University and President of today's function to present the memento to our Chief Guest Sri N. Balram Garu, IRS Chairman and Managing Director, Singareni Colliery Companies Limited, Hyderabad, as a symbol of our gratitude and respect. Now I request the chief guest Shri N Balram Garu to present a memento to Professor P Lakshmanarayan Garu Registrar Usmania University Now I request Prof. P. Lakshmanarayan Garu to present a memento to Shri Srinivasa Kakuman Garu, Managing Director and CEO, Moss Chip Technologies. Now I request the Chief Guest Sri N Balram Garu to present a memento to Prof. P Chandrasekhar Garu, Principal University College of Engineering, Usmania University. Now I request the chief guest to present a memento to Prof. A. Krishnaya Garu, Director, CDAC, University College of Engineering, Usmania University.
Now I request the chief guest to present a memento to Dr. D. Vijay Kumar Garu, President OUCE Alumni Association, Usmania University. Now I request the chief guest to present a memento to Dr. M. Sham Sundar, Joint Director of Evaluation UG, Examination Cell, University College of Engineering, OU. Now I request the chief guest to present a memento to Dr. P. Lokendra Reddy, Joint Director of Evaluation PG, Exam Cell OU. Now I request the chief guest to present a memento to Professor Narsimulu Sankegaru, Director of Evaluation, Examination Cell, University College of Engineering, Usmania University. Thank you, sir. Now I request the dignitaries to fel felicitate the donors with the bouquet. Giving is not just about the donation, it's about making a difference. We are happy and blessed for your great support and belief in doing good. We couldn't have made it possible without incredible donors like you. I now invite Mr. S. N. Reddy, Donor of late Tasildar Shri S. Parvatareddy Gold Medal Award to please come on to the dais, sir. Request the dignitaries to, to felicitate the donor. Now I request Professor P. Lakshminarina, donor of Dr. B. R. Ambedkar gold medal, sir, <laughs> request the dignitaries to please felicitate the donor. I request the concerned person of uh, Sri Maram Raju Narsimha Rao gold medal. If anyone is there, 
representing the donor of Sri Maram Raju Narsima Rao. Three donors. Uh, any, uh, do you, any other donor is there here? Please join us. We thank all the donors who have come, who have not uh, come today. Thank you all. Now I request Dr. M. Shams Sundar, Joint Director of Evaluation UG, Examination Cell, to propose the vote of thank. Thank you, sir. So before I propose formal vote of thanks, on behalf of the entire college and my own behalf, I congratulate all the awardees of gold medals and cash awards for exhibiting their academic and excellence. Now I move forward to propose formal vote of thanks. It's my prime privilege to thank today's chief guest, Sri N. Balram Garu, IRS, Chairman and Managing Director, Singareni Collieries Company Limited, Hyderabad. In spite of his busy schedule, sir has readily accepted our invitation to be the chief guest of today's function and grace the occasion. It is indeed a great pleasure to have you, sir. We are truly motivated and inspired by your speech, sir. Thank you, sir, for coming. I would like to take this opportunity to express my sincere thanks to Honorable Vice Chancellor Usmania University, Sri M. Dana Kishore Garu, IAS, Principal Secretary, Municipal Administration and Urban Development, Governor of Telangana, for his support. I extend my heartfelt thanks to distinguished alumni awardee. Sri Gopal T.K. Krishnagaru, B.E. Class of 1968, Founder and President Krishna Engineering Consultants, Iowa State, USA, for gracing this event and accepting our Distinguished Alumni Award. We are indeed grateful to you for all your general support to your alma mater, sir. Thank you for coming, sir. I also extend our heartfelt thanks to our beloved guests of honor, Prof. P. Lashminarayana Garu, Registrar Usmania University, and one of our pride alumni, Sri Srinivasa Kakumanu, Managing Director and CEO, Mastership Technologies, for gracing uh, gracious presence and for their extremely motivating address. Thank you for coming, sir. I am extremely thankful to all the governing body and academic council members for their gracious presence, constant support and encouragement. I take this opportunity to specially thank our beloved principal, Prof. P. Chandrasekhar Garu, for being the catalyst that stimulated us to do our best. He is the hidden guiding force at every level in organization of this event. I extend my sincere gratitude to Prof. A. Krishnaya Garu, Director CDAC, and Prof. K. Shamala Garu, Dean, Faculty of Engineering for their continuous support and valuable guidance. We are very proud of our distinguished alumni who have been glorifying our prestigious institute by their superlative achievements. Their contributions have always been commendable and the role of alumni association is highly appreciable. I wholeheartedly thank the President of Alumni Association, Dr. D. Vijay Kumar Garu, for all his dedicated efforts. I take this opportunity to profusely thank all the donors for contributing towards gold medals and cash awards. Because of your generosity, we are able to conduct academic award function every year. This helps the college to appreciate and motivate the students for the, their academic excellence. I thank all the heads of the departments, chairpersons of Board of Studies, Autonomous, Director SEEP, all administrative officers, members of various committees, all faculty members, deputy registrar, non-teaching staff, caretaker of the college who have shared the burden in making this event a delightful and memorable one. I extend my thanks to student volunteers for their untiring efforts in organizing this event. I would like to express our sincere thanks to print and media persons for their coverage. An event of this nature would not have been successful without meticulous planning and execution. I am fortunate to have a team of very motivated and committed staff of the examination cell and supporting staff of the principal office. I am short of words for their involvement and willingness to take on the completion of the task beyond their comfort zones. Once again, I thank you all for your kind attention. I request all of you to stand for a national anthem.
नायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता पंजाब सिंध गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उत्कल बंगा विंग हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्चल जल तरंगा तब शुभ नामे जागे तब शुभ आशीष मागे गाहे तब जय गाधा जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे जय हिंद I request all the students, parents, and guests to join for the dinner right side of this assembly hall. <laughs>